Where is that squirrel? Oh no, 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 scrat! No. Hi everyone, I'm Lorenzo, and in this video, I'm going to talk about all Ice Age games I could find for Java. Ice Age Village is a town builder game, but Ice Age themed. You can make some sort of animal city. The graphics look modern, well, it was released in 2013, it's understandable why the game looks so good. It's a good game, if you are into this type of stuff, the town builder type of game and like Ice Age, then try it. Okay, you can like it even if you don't like Ice Age. I mean, it's a, it's a good game, it's a well built game. Ice Age 2 is unique, it's a side scroller where you run with scrap. But unlike others, you don't stop while running. You can only reduce the speed or run faster. There are things along your run that spice things up, a lot of animations and many things happening on ice. Basically, you run away to escape threats and collect nuts. And animations, variety and locations are plenty. Try it out. Ice Age 3 Dawn of Dinosaurs it's an action adventure. It's an isometric game with good production value. You have as playable character Sid and Buck. You get flying levels, isometric platformers. You can throw stuff and have some decent combat. The game is pretty neat. Try it out, especially if you're a fan. Ice Age Mammoth Mayhem is another isometric game. This time with mammoths. It's the previous game but more simplified, meaning that you get less cutscenes, less details and less variety, but it's still a decent game. Ice Age 4 Continental Drift is a classic side-scroller, like you would expect on Java. As playable characters you get Scrat, Manny and Sid, it doesn't have that much variety, it's mostly platforming, but the graphics and visuals overall are very impressive. And the game is enjoyable, a little bland, but still simple and enjoyable. Ok, visually it's a feast, but gameplay wise, well, it's a usual side scroller. And Scrat Ventures is a Scrat game. It's enjoyable, with nice controls, nice visuals, lots of animations, but while playing I've noticed that the game almost plays by itself, I mean, the game is very easy to beat. This must be a game solely made for kids. I mean, for a kid, this game is very fun. You press the keys shown on screen and scratch jumps and tumbles and falls and does all sorts of funny stuff. But for people of older ages than a toddler, well, they shouldn't play the game. Okay, maybe to relax. It's a good relief to, relax, to play this game just to relax. Anyway, just know that it's very easy to beat, but looks enjoyable. I mean, it's a feast visually, like older Java games are. Okay, so this was the video. If you liked it, please hit the like button and subscribe. And if you want, follow me on Twitch, Instagram or Discord. I left the links to those in the video description. Also, if you want to see another video of mine, just wait till I stop talking and there will be thumbnails of other videos I've made. Thanks for watching.